And then in 1973, uh, the stock got very cheap because their television licenses were under challenge by B.B. Rebozo, Nixon's friend. And the, the stock went from, I think, like 38 to 16 or so in a very short period of time. And when it got down to around 20, uh, just in a few blocks, we bought almost 10 percent of the of, of the company. And that now is about 18 percent because they've repurchased shares. When it got to about 20, that meant the whole Washington Post company, it had 4,800,000 shares of The whole Washington Post company was selling for $100 million. Now they owned the Washington Post, they owned Newsweek, they owned four big network television stations, including, including CBS Washington, Washington, and Washington DC and, and all of that. Jacksonville, Florida. I mean everything, and they didn't know any money. And if you had taken those separate parts, you literally could have been out in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean, you know, at midnight in a rowboat,